Environmental groups sued earlier this year, claiming that Montana's wolf trapping regulations were reasonably certain to cause incidental harm to grizzly bears. In response, a federal district judge in Missoula ordered the trapping season to be significantly shortened to the time when almost all grizzlies are expected to be in their dens for winter. Judge Donald Malloy ruled the plaintiffs had established serious questions about the impact if the trapping season went forward as planned. He issued a preliminary injunction and ordered the season in much of the state to be limited to January 1st through February 15th. The ruling applies across western and central Montana, where the vast majority of wolf trapping occurs. This summer, the State Fish and Wildlife Commission adopted wolf trapping regulations with a season running from November 27th to March 15th, but with a floating start date in areas considered occupied grizzly habitat. So trapping wouldn't begin until fish, wildlife, and parks reported bears were in their dens in those areas. The plaintiffs argued the state had underestimated the chance of bears getting accidentally caught in wolf traps. Malloy said those arguments were persuasive, and that changes to this year's regulations made the risk higher. Governor Greg Gianforte issued a statement defending the state's management of both species and calling Malloy's ruling judicial activism. The state has already appealed Malloy's decision, but the appeals court hasn't taken any action so far. FWP leaders say they're going to continue to track when grizzlies are denning, in case the injunction is overturned and the floating start date reinstated. At McDonald Pass, Jonathan Amberian, MTN News.